or someone at the court could facilitate our receipt of the draft transcript, today's draft transcript, over the weekend. Um, I wanted to raise it as soon as possible in case there's any technical issue involved, but that would help us uh, greatly if we, could, if we could have that over the weekend. We'll be checking our email, and we do assume that we will be able to put quotations to Professor Chandler as to what he said in court. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you ហើយមុនទស្សនារៈនេះតុលាការបានសម្រេចលើសំណើសុំរបស់ <coughs> ទៀតសម្រាប់ថ្ងៃច័ន្ទទៀតខ្ញុំមាត់គាត់ទៅចង់ដឹងទេហើយអាការអនុវត្តបែបនេះបាទពុះ <coughs> គឺជាសិទ្ធិចន្ទានុសិទ្ធិរបស់អង្គជម្រះអង្គជម្រះនឹងធ្លឹងថ្លែងអំពីបញ្ហានេះឲ្យបានសំត្រប់បំផុតក
Well, Son San, as part of the party center, was involved in important aspects. Uh, Drake did not bother him with all the confessions at all. It was a, just important aspects of what was going on there were reported by Doak, including uh, some texts of confessions. Thank you. Um, I'd like to take a look at another uh, document from, a, uh, from an S21 file. And this is the penultimate document we'll be looking at today. Um, it is document number IS 5.30. Um, I believe it's only available in. Uh, it is available in all three languages. Um, the Khmer ERN is English ERN is And French it is in the bundle that was provided to no, Professor Chan. Um, it is a communication by um, uh, the individual we discussed earlier, Munim, um, um, to a number of people. Uh, if my colleagues could display it on the screen, uh, it is ready now. Uh, so that the public and other Khmer speakers can also see the communication we are discussing. Um, Professor Chandler, in the interest of time, I might read it. Um, and then ask you just one or two follow-up questions. It's, it starts with number one. <laughs> Respected Communist Party of Kampuchea, worth more than my life, my respect to Brother Paul, Brother Nguyen, Brother Van, Brother Vaughan, Kadri Kiu, and Hem. And the beginning of that next paragraph is as follows. Today, 10 April 1977, while I was extremely busy preparing a radio broadcast to memorialize the second anniversary of the great victory of 17 April 1975, Kadre Pong called me on the phone to work with Ankar. I was very surprised and did not expect to be arrested by our military. Now, further down that same passage, um, he says, I am trying to prove my loyalty to Ankar in order to get a fair judgment. And he ends with, I firmly reassure the party that I have never betrayed the party at all. I have never been involved with the CIA, the Vietnamese, or Son Nhok Tan's agents or brothers. ຈຸດມີຕະວີສົມອົກຄຸນຕິນສາທໄມ <coughs> ខ្ញុំថាអានចំឡោយសារភាពរបស់ហើយសារបស់ជនរងគ្រោះរបស់នៅមន្ទីរ Thank you Mr President um, the prohibition in the convention against torture applies only to material established to have been made as a result of torture. This, Your Honours, is not a confession. This is a letter from uh, an individual arrested prior to his interrogation and torture uh, to uh, those individuals that are named. Um, it clearly explains that it was today, on the 10th of April, that I was arrested. 
So clearly the letter is written shortly following the arrest. Uh, it is a plea for uh, what it appears to be a, a communication, I don't want to interpret it. Um, but it is clearly not a confession, it is not a standard uh, document that S21 staff were directed to extract from, from uh, prisoners. It, the convention against torture does not apply. ដោយសារយំទោសរបស់មេធាវីជាតិការពីក្រៃលោកអៀងទារីគ្មានប្រសិទ្ធភាពគាត់មានការផលចលំលើខ្លឹមសារនៃអឯកសារឯកពងដា
and asked for instructions from Ankara. Then, in relation to uh, 106, the, the, next, the next passage, um, his comrades sought uh, reporting to Ankara on the situation. Um, on the point A, he says, um, or rather, he stated, comrades sought brought up a number of matters, the problems of many sick people in the work sites, a loss of 40 per cent of the labor force. Um, I will skip uh, the, the discussion that follows and go straight to the opinions and instructions of Ankar. This is at Roman numeral 3, and if we could show that on the screen, so I will start reading. Regarding the problems in 303 as measures, first point, must call in those named to question them to see what their responses are. We will not yet remove them from their positions. Next, call them in for further questioning in front of their accusers and watch to see their reactions. Therefore, there are two stages. Question and keep them at one site and report to upper echelon along with a case file. Professor, we saw that um, it was Comrade Shrang that had reported on the situation in 303 and then we see opinions and instructions of Ankar about how to deal with um, certain individuals. Um, what, if anything, does this signify in terms of the party centre's um, involvement in oversight of activities uh, in the regions? Well, I think it suggests uh, strong oversight on issues that were considered important and were given to them, uh, sent up to them to, uh, to discuss. I think the number of people uh, involved in that uh, particular thing, uh, the, the group of uh, 34 people and the other group that attempted to escape, that, was enough to distress them and say, okay, we'll question these people, bring them in, bring them in obviously to a prison facility in the district where they were, were held office. Do not remove them from their positions, means they would have some official position of some sort that's not defined. So yeah, it's a close, close, uh, close supervision of certain as of aspects brought to their attention, that's what you can say. Thank you, Professor. And my final question for today. Um, and I, it's really by way of um, uh, looking at our discussions over the last two uh, or three days and um, uh, considering uh, your uh, evidence on the collective leadership at the helm at the top. Um, I just want to ensure that we fully understand um, where your opinions stand um, uh, remove any doubt as to, um, as to uh, perhaps the way you may have framed this, these issues. Um, but I will allow you to comment. Um, I want to read from the tragedy of uh, Cambodian history. Um, I'm not showing you the document. I will just read a brief passage. Um, this appears at ERN. 00193302 is only available in English. Um, and this is, you're dealing with continuities between the CPK regime and those that preceded them. And this is what um, you state there. In terms of practice, a major continuity was that DK held it proper to concentrate power in the hands of a single person. Prince Papa and Ma Marshal Lon were followed by Comrade Secretary Pol Pot in an attempt to destroy the personalism that, in their view, had corrupted previous regimes. The CPK stressed the collective nature of its leadership and kept most of its leaders hidden. Nonetheless, its style of operation, with its lack of accountability, its self deification, its monopoly on information, and its single voice uttering unchallengeable commands amounted to one-man rule. And by 1977, brother number one, Pol Pot, and brother number two, Nguyen Chia, had become synonymous with the organization. Another continuity that connected Sihanouk 
Lonol and the collective leadership around Pol Pot was that these men and women in the DK case saw themselves as new types of rulers, a private citizen monarch, a non-monarchic chief of state, a set of comrades wielding national power. Now, my question is simply, we're dealing, it's a, it's a slightly complex uh, passage, but it, there's a reference there to um, uh, one man rule, but there are also references to collective leadership. And as we see towards the end, um, a set of comrades wielding national power. Um, I just want to ask you to, um, if you could, elaborate for us on, on, on what you meant by the use of the, the phrase uh, one man rule uh, as opposed to collective leadership and a group of comrades wielding national power. That's, that's a passage that after uh, 22 years I might revise slightly. I've uh, come to the belief that I've read a lot more material since I wrote that passage, that the leadership of democratic Kampuchea was more collective than I thought, although, as it, I think comes true in the documents we've seen, the decisions handed down by Paul Pot were the final ones. He was, in fact, the executive leader of the country. And this is certainly the way many Cambodians view that period. They call it the Pol Pot era. But I do want to say that I, I, if I were to rewrite, redo the passage or re revisit it, I would say that the leadership was, from all the evidence that I've seen since then, more truly collective than the evidence I had to use in 1990, which was before I could come back to Cambodia. I wrote the book before I came back to Cambodia. I thank you very much, Professor, and I thank so the honors for the time allocated to us. That concludes our presentation. សូមជើញបាទសូមគ្រប់លោកចាក់ក្រមប្រធានលោកលោកសេចក្រមអង្គសាបនាការទំងមូលមេត្តវីនៅមុខបាន <coughs> ក្រុមលោកស្រីចក្រមព្រមទាំងអង្គសាបនាការទីក្រុមបានហ៊ុំកំសួនជាមេត្តាវីតំណាងឲ្យដើមមិនដឹងរត់ពុនេះនៅក
that's a period, of course, we've, we've not discussed previously uh, the exact relationship between the uh, ISRAC and the KPRP in that period. I think you'd more accurately, I mean to say it was inaccurate what you said, but I think that period was a period in which the KPRP did not exist. The relationship of the ISRAC to at various factions, some of which uh, were uh, encouraged by Thailand, some of which were entirely local, and uh, some of which were encouraged by uh, Vietnam, uh, by the Vietnam, by the Chinese Communist Party. Uh, the KPRP, founded in 1951, used elements drawn from all three of these uh, factions, the Thai-supported faction, the local faction, and the Vietnamese-supported faction, and basically uh, didn't accept a certain Isarak figures whose, uh, who wanted, uh, whose main goal uh, was independ Cambodia's independence from France with no uh, other social program uh, of the sort that was gradually de uh, developed by the KPRP. The KPRP was uh, founded, uh, the record indicates this very clearly, was founded by uh, and encouraged to exist by the Vietnamese. Its statutes were written in Vietnamese and translated into Khmer. Its leaders were uh, Cambodians who were fluent in Vietnamese. And for many years, this party was, uh, served as an adjunct to the uh, concealed Indochinese party which was the political arm of the first Indochina war fought by the Vietnamese against, and, and the Cambodians and the Lao against the French. Uh, so that relationship uh, between the, if you want to say, uh, non-communist uh, Isarak and the increasingly or drawn toward the communist movement, uh, members of that movement, these started off uh, identical in, say, 45, 46, independence for Cambodia and so on, and then shifted to a more uh, international program on the part of the uh, KPRP. In other words, this, one of its purposes was to join Vietnam and Laos in an Indo-Chinese struggle against the French, whereas other people interested more in Cambodia than in uh, international uh, factors. and um, how should we say? Um, well, they found no. They yeah. found themselves uh, un unhappy with the program of the uh, KPRP as it developed. These people drifted off into other uh, resistance movements, which were eventually, by and large, absorbed by the senior government. I'm sorry for the detail, but it, it's, a, it's a complicated question that's important for your studying aspect of roots of the uh, CPK. ບາດສົມຄຸນອໍາໄມມັນລົກບານມີປະຊາຊົນຈຳລຽບຈູນຕໍ່ດອນອົງສະບັນນາກາແຕ່ຕົງຊິມຸຍ <laughs> สนุรบอกខ្ញុំសួរថាតើអ៊ីស្រាអ៊ុនដែលនៅក្នុងចំណោមសម័យតស៊ូអ៊ីស្រាអ៊ុនមានខ្លាយខ្លួនមកជាម
a member of the uh, reconstituted central committee. ពីសាខ្មែរអង់គ្លេសអង្គ្លេសសួនអានលេខឯកសារម្ដងទីលោកទៀតបាទឯកសារលេខ <cười> សូនសូនប្រាំបួនបីមួយមួយប្រាំមួយនៅក្នុងតំពន់ទី Uh, certainly, Dap Chuan uh, <coughs> was uh, not, uh, he was a member of the Israq and eventually defected to Sinuk and then was, uh, uh, went into rebellion against Sinuk in 1959 and was assassinated at that point. Uh, always a, an anti-communist uh, figure who had served in the Thai army, uh, uh, leader of the Sim Reap region, uh, uh, Long Bun Rut, which is one of the names of uh, uh, when Chia returned to Cambodia from uh, Thailand, where he'd been working uh, in the late, in the, uh, I'm not going to make this uh, date uh, something that uh, I'm swearing to, it's at 49, I think it's like 49.50, came in to uh, help the resistance. He was already a member of the uh, Thai Communist Party, but he was not, as far as I can tell, because I think his work was mainly in the Northwest where he came from. I'm not sure that he was at this stage under any kind of uh, discipline uh, by the uh, Vietnamese, and he certainly doesn't figure in documents uh, surrounding the early years of the Cambodian Revolutionary Party. But uh, certainly, but you're, you're right. I, I stand corrected in saying there were none of the Thai-sponsored ones. He was hardly one of the figures sponsored by the anti-French uh, Thai government, uh, and, and which <coughs> sought at the end of World War II to make uh, trouble in Cambodia, make sure the French did not reassert themselves in, in, uh, in the country. Uh, but he was a uh, Cambodian uh, patriot who had uh, spent some time in Thailand and had decided or uh, yeah, come, come to the view that uh, the uh, injustices and uh, and uh, crimes, if you like, oh, of yeah. uh, the French uh, colonial regime uh, deserve to be met with, uh, with force, and so he was happy to join uh, the resistance movement. Exactly what form that joining took or what his activities were uh, may be clear in documents I haven't read, but I don't, I'm not ready to say what they were. អសមគុណអំបាញ់មិញលោកបានមានប្រសាសន៍ច្រើនហើយតាក់ទងជាមួយនឹងអឺសកម្មជនឬក៏ 
ຈະລາຍຈະບໍ່ມີຄວາມຫຼາຍຫຼາຍຫຼາຍຫຼາຍຫຼາຍຫຼາຍຫຼາຍຫຼາຍຫຼາຍຫຼາຍຫຼາ
ที่สมมติเราบอกเขาจองสู้ลูกท่านกขนมจนรักฉันนำมาปอนผมบูนโรยหกสับมาตัวมาปอนโรยจัดสับนี่คือเจี๊ยเปรุเลียดได้ระดับบ๊อบสังคมเรียนนิยมหรือก็ยกจังยี่เจี๊ยทัจีระบบดักนอมได้สมได้ระดับเสนุจังเจี๊ยสมนุขยมสู้ท่าตาการนอมอ้อยเมย์ทอมทอมในปะกุมดิการปีเจียรถจุลปรีนึงมีนหายเพศยังไม่คลาดแต่ตระบานกอดรถจุลปรีบานเนี่ยจุ่มเรียงกันมาตอนสไลด์จำตระบองจุ่มเนี่ยสไลด์เลยการจุ่มตัวระบบคางเบตวีการเปลี่ยนกระไดทำเจลูกเบตวีบาสมอคุณลูกเทียนขยมบาบยุลขึ้นท่าเมตวีดามดังรถเป็นนี้อาจมีการยุลจะล้อมจมปัวแล้วท่าเมดังน้อมกุมนี้รถจบไปจมดังนี้สมอยเป็นเจ้าอิจบ้าท่าจีนนาพองบ่าดับไปเอาอ่อนจุลยิ่งเรียกอัจฉริยะเป็นนิชัยบานสมคุณมาสมคุณชมสมกายตุ่มเร้าเนื้อเปียระบอกสมบัติมาหมิ่งหลังเว้นได้สาขนมนกบีมีนมนุษย์ชราอันได้เจี๊ยสกามจุนนกขนมปะกุมนิกามจีจังชมสมกายตุ่มเร้าท่าตาลูกอาจจุลยิบจุนอังสับนาคาบานเตถ่ามนุษย์ได้จัดตุกท่าจีเนี่ยจอนขปูหรือสกามจุนปุ่งปูในปะกุมนิกามจีขนมจันทร์ล็อกชนะมาปอนผมบูนโดยหกสัปดาห์มาปอนผมบูนโดยจัดสัปดาห์รถกิจครูนโจขนมเปรี้ยนนู้ตาดงมีนจำตามีนชมนาคลาเต I think the translation. Uh, 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 phrase of, of uh, 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 considered is a, might be a little bit misleading. I, I think he would say we're known to fellow members of the Communist Party to be. There was no one else considering them. Sinuk had no idea who was running the Communist Party. Uh, he didn't know there was such an organization in existence. He knew there were people that he called uh, Khmer Kaholm or, or, or Khmer Rouge. But he was not aware of these figures. Uh, however, in 19, I think February 1963, in one of his long uh, speeches, oh, no, there had been some uh, uh, opposition to his rule had been expressed. In, I forget in the papers or somewhere. And Lon Nol, his uh, his uh, military assistant, gave him a list of 34 known left-wing people in uh, Kampen, primarily, who. He could question or name, as he did name them in a, in a speech, and then in a flamboyant Sinukian uh, fashion, he invited these 34 people to form a government and take his place. Uh, two of the figures named in this, uh, among these 34, which included the names of the three ghosts, for example, the later people who became the three ghosts, were... Uh, Yingsri and Pol Pot, who had been teaching in a private school in Phnom Penh with secret connections, of course, all connections secret to the Communist Party, and they thought that this sudden flash of flashlight on them meant that, or they may have thought, I have to say may have thought, okay, uh, that Sihanouk knew their positions inside the party, which is not the case. But the fact is they were As Son Sen was another man who was mentioned uh, in the thing, had came to the same conclusions as uh, Pol Pot and Yung Sri had not previously been named as one of the Khmer Rouge. So these three people uh, fled to eastern Cambodia uh, soon afterwards, where they took refuge in a Vietnamese uh, military, Vietnamese communist military base, were soon joined by several other cadre members. They're listed in the appendix of uh, brother number one. I can't remember them all at the moment. And a year later, they were joined by their wives. An interesting, uh, uh, the point that might concern the court today is that two figures who did not flee to the jungle were uh, Kyusampan and Nunchia. Kyusampan, because he had a, was, must, have, must have felt 
uh, relatively secure in terms of uh, his future in Phnom uh, Penh and Nguyen Chia because he was not mentioned among the 34. His position was, if you like, even more secret than uh, Pol Pot. He did not teach, uh, known to teach in a, no, he didn't teach. But certainly there were no records of his being a teacher then at one of the private schools. The documents readily accessible to the regime. So this is a person whose name was not on the list. So he stayed behind. Uh, uh, whether I think he and uh, Paul Pot must have agreed at some stage that this was something that would be of use to the party to keep a member who had not been mentioned in the city to uh, continue what activities the, commun the party was engaged in at the time. So there were several leaders who fled, soon joined by other members, but the ones, uh, the two who did not flee of the important store activities here is uh, Kisapan Nunchia. Kisapan fled later, of course, we know that, but uh, the October 62. Thank you, uh, Mr. President. Um, just a, um, a point that I want to raise with uh, Professor Chandler through your ch trial chamber, of course. Um, I understand Professor Chandler is an expert witness, and I understand, as the prosecution uh, stated before, that he needs to think he is an expert and he derives conclusions. But I would appreciate it that if he speaks about, for example, our clients, that he can make the distinction between uh, when he is speculating or assuming or when he's actually basing his opinion on certain documents. In this instance, I heard the professor say that Nguyen uh, Chia did not flee into the jungle because he felt safe because he was not mentioned in this list of uh, 34. Um, I understand that is uh, Professor Chandler's opinion, but if he has any supporting documents or any supporting information for that, could he indicate that? And otherwise, could he uh, be careful to keep stating that these are his conclusions? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. បាទជើញតទៀតមិនមានបញ្ហាអ្វីទេបាទសូមអរគុណសូមអរគុណលោកទីវិជ្ជានលើដែលលោកបានរៀបរាប់តេតុងជាមួយ <coughs> ກິດຄລູນຫຼືກໍມີຊ່ວຍໃນក្នុងບັນຊີໃນລະບົບອ່າ <coughs> ក្រោមការដឹកនាំរបស់សម្ដេចព្រះនរោត្តមសេនុមានការធ្វើទុកបុគ្គមនិញឬក៏ចាប់កាត់សម្លាប់ដោយសារតែការយកដីឬក៏
as certainly we heard earlier of the <coughs> Sanlat Rebellion in 1967, which was put down very brutally. There's lots of evidence of uh, students uh, and members of pro-Chinese uh, associations in uh, Phnom Penh, which were taking a Maoist uh, cultural revolutionary stand, were being harassed and in some cases uh, eliminated. I've had interviews with people who had relatives who were uh, uh, put in prison and uh, so on at this time. Dick was imprisoned at this time. Uh, uh, he was uh, rounded up and imprisoned. Let me make a slight clarification from the beginning of your question. Uh, I, I want to make clear, my, I thought I made it clear. These 34 were not, never identified as members of a communist party. These were identified as dangerous left-wing people who are here in uh, Cambodia and in danger my regime. And they included uh, prominent journalists, they included uh, it, members of the uh, Cambodian National Assembly, such as uh, you know, Kisampan and others. This is all the people that they knew had opinions that were pro-left. And th this is not, they weren't hard to find at this time because Sinuk's own views internationally uh, on international affairs, were very pro-left, very anti-American and pro-Chinese, pro, pro if you like. So this was a line that was followed by many, and believed in, I think, by many intellectuals in Cambodia. There were more left-wing people in Cambodia than there were members of the Communist Party. So I was saying that uh, the people who, were, who fled were people who had been named as leftists, but were in fact secret members of the Central Committee, Son Sen, uh, uh, mean, uh, no, sorry, Son Sen, Yang Sri, and Pol Pot. And there were some others who followed them later. But Min Chia remained behind, and that's documented, I should get back to the counselor's point, that's documented in his own autobiography that is available. I don't know if the court bill has certainly been around. He said he remained behind, so he did remain behind. It's not a supposition on my part, it's also, so that's just the point that I want to stress. I mean, it's, it's open knowledge that he stayed behind. His motives for staying behind, those are not in my position. I can't say what they are. Sounds to uh, me as if supposition he felt safe. If he didn't feel safe, uh, he wouldn't have stayed. But that's uh, maybe that's too much of a supposition. Uh, ยุลทาอาจมีสวัสดิภาพตามการได้กอดรักษาการสำงานบ้างเราสมัครคุณสมสู่โลกมันติดจะทราบวิทยาตรงขึ้นเนี่ยสมนุนนี่ยังชั่
problems which they were starting to see. Young people were not getting jobs, uh, the economy was not going well, etc. So in this context, uh, it's perfectly uh, understandable that a popular rebellion could exist without a Communist Party leadership, and I think that's what happened. Pardon me for the I think, but that's, that's what seems to have happened. ແລະສົມຄຸນຄຸນຈອງສູ່ສຳນູນນັ້ນຕຽກຕົງ <coughs> I can't say I observed it because I wasn't here, but I didn't read anything about uh, extensive starvation at that time. With respect, I think this issue has been dealt with before, but just to, to reiterate, uh, there was certainly a close connection. This was the this was a decision made by the uh, by the CPK. It's been documented uh, and it <coughs> set off or, in, or inspired or was inspired by the very first uh, armed action by the CPK against uh, government forces. But I think I've talked about this before. I don't want to be repetitive. ដោយសមគុណខ្ញុំសូមជួលទៅដល់បាត់បាត់ក្នុងឆ្នាំ <coughs> ចលនាប្រឆាំងជាច្រើនពីប្រជាពលរដ្ឋដែលនៅគ្រាន់ត្រូវសម្ដេចនរោត <coughs> I, no, I don't think I can go into much detail on that. So, uh, I, I mentioned before this is a, and I think we have discussed this before, uh, the uh, tape recordings of a speech uh, by Sinuk urging his uh, children, as he called them, to go into revolt were spread into Cambodia uh, by uh, Vietnamese forces and broadcast widely. There's very mixed reports about the effect of these broadcasts. Some people say they had you know, wide support, some people say very little. But certainly there was an effort on the part of the resistance at the beginning to, to say that the resistance was primarily to restore Sinuk to power. This was to uh, take advantage of a good deal of anti-coup d'etat feeling that there was in Cambodia. They, they'd been used to having a king for time immemorial. From one day to the next, he was gone, and they was widely liked, actually, particularly in the countryside. So it was confusing. But the Communist Party of Kampuchea uh, because of its now open alliance, or its renewed, let's say renewed from the 1950s, open alliance with the armed forces of Vietnam was an, ad ad an advantage to climb into this resistance movement, may saying the right sentences about Sinuk, but primarily seeking, as we've seen from many, many documents, 
Chief Olong to come to power in their own right. បាទសមុទ្រគុណសំនួតតាក់ទងគ្នានេះដែរខ្ញុំចង់សួរលោកថាតើពេលដែលមានរដ្ឋប្រហារក្រោយថ្ងៃ <coughs> I think I, uh, I think I explained that in my previous answer. I think they, for a time, uh, pretended or, or took the position that appearing pro scenic would get them more supporters, and there's lots of evidence that this did get them uh, quite a bit of support in the rural areas. So it was certainly to their advantage. But the main thing that was to their advantage, it seems to me, was that Wang Mao, in his uh, characteristically, had uh, declared war on the, uh, not officially, but uh, on the Vietnamese, and so wanted them all out of the country in, in uh, 48 hours. And uh, in fact, they didn't leave. And uh, the Khmer Rouge mo movement was able to join with them, they themselves using pro sienic propaganda at the time, because the Vietnamese communists had been uh, secretly allied with uh, Sinuk in many ways and promised not to uh, uh, shoot any of his troops and so on. So, yeah, it was to their, the, the coup was definitely to the, to the advantage of the CPK aided by other circumstances, the context. But so much good. Nepal, no doubt, can sum so look at that look at when you want to look at the Dung Bantit, ha, but cheap or rot, the proud beat, ha, rot your prima key. Let the quam throw Cholana, Tasu, Prashang, or Bob Lunol. Ta peat churn. Pitchana, but cheap or rot, you'll coin ta, can not say, and watch it come with cheer, dial Chimunik, Grana Chica, a Kuchia. I'm afraid that's impossible to say because we don't have the documentation, but it, it seems to me that a lot of them initially uh, fled because the situation in their country had changed so radically that they couldn't understand what had happened, and many of them uh, listened and uh, supported the speech of uh, Sino. We don't know how many of these people there were, and nor do we know how many of these people stayed in the resistance movement and evolved into members of the CPK. Certainly there were some who did follow that route. There were certainly others who dropped out of the resistance as soon as it became clear to them uh, what was uh, about its uh, political affiliations. But I can't substantiate this with, with documents or numbers, so it probably can't give you a clear answer. បាទសូមអរគុណបន្តទៅទៀតខ្ញុំសូមជម្រាបសួរលោកថានៅក្នុងសិផោរបស់លោកដែលមានចំណងជាងថាបងធំទី 1 ปรำปีปรำปีปรำปรำปีหนึ่งอีออันจีภาษาอังกฤษโซนโซนใบปรำบูนใบโซนโซนปรำปีดันนิยายอันปีกองตอบกุมนิมีนวินัยคลังจิ
ប៉ុន្តែក្រុមទាំងពីរនេះបានប្រព្រឹត្តអំពើលួចផ្លន់ជ្រើសរើសតបនឹងធ្វើបាបជាជនຊິມາຈູນຈະອ້າຍກິສາຕະລົກວະສັນຈະລູກຕະກາບານເນາະເນາະອາດອັນອັນນີ້ uh, poorly armed, uh, the Senu could never prepare an army with sufficient forces, sufficient weapons to uh, defend the, his country, and this was uh, proved to be a, a fatal decision on his part in the sense that there was no army that could defend the country uh, when it was really uh, faced a major force, which is that of the uh, combined forces of the NLF and the North Vietnamese. <coughs> but yes, indeed, um, you don't have stories coming out from uh, refugees or people. A lot of documentation for this period because, <coughs> sorry, there was an American embassy in Phnom Penh. There were people reports coming in from Vietnam <coughs> that the um, other side was much more disciplined, did not uh, commit offenses in the villages, had very strict almost Buddhist code of behavior that they uh, promulgated, and I think it increased or <coughs> really uh, uh, set in motion their popularity. Sorry. លោកសំនួរបន្តិចតិចចោះព្រោះតេតុងជាមួយនឹងមសិលម៉ែងនេះគឺជាថ្ងៃទី 19 នឹងលោកម្នាក់ទៀតខ្ញុំចាំឈ្មោះមិនអស់ហើយពេលនោះពេលមិនសម័យនេះលោកបានជម្រាបថាពេលហ្នឹងមានការសម្រេចឲ្
lines, which as we know were secretly arranged, but he tried, I think, uh, quite admirably to say the kinds of things that he thought would be appropriate for an international audience about his forces, but at least, as I mentioned the other day, on one occasion he told a journalist, when they're through with me, they'll spit me out like a cherry pit. So, the leadership knew what kind of a person they were dealing with, and they felt, I think, that he needed monitoring. And the Anxiri uh, was considered to be the person best equipped to do that. ແລະນີ້ຕໍ່ປີສົມເຈີ້ລູກວິດີສົມ <coughs> ពណ៌ទីមួយខ្ញុំក្នុងគណៈដែលលោកសាសាចារ្យណាចំណេញបានអានកំណត់ដៃរកំណត់ត្រារបស់លោកនៅលើនៅចំពោះមុខលោក ជាកំណត់ហេតុទីមួយនឹងសំនួរអានឹងសំនំពលរបស់ខ្ញុំទីមួយទី <coughs> 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 ລະດົບບົງໂດຍມັນບານໃນໃຫ້ຖ້າແນ່ຈຳນຽງອາດປາເອີ້ສໍາໄດ້ອົບປະມານວິທີ <coughs> ប្រសិនបើអ្នកជំនាញនិយាយថាខ្លួនបានឃើញបានដឹងដោយផ្ទាល់នោះគឺវាខុសទៅទួលនីតិជាអ្នកជំនាញហើយគណៈបានឃើ
vì thiên này cả su nâng phá bắt đầu tạm nâng đại ớt của cô nhóm cọt xung quanh khơi cả lọc máu miên sức xâm nụ nó mục trở ra ta cả này xâm lạp su nẹ chấm niên chẳng dưỡng ai su xâm nụ nó mục bàn đá rư cò mẫn bàn lục của thiên ai ai bánh tốt nhưng bánh thay mấy cô đăng tăng bị đá mấy cô mình mình chấm to tham miên xâm nụ nó mục bà ta khiêm chẳng ai miên xâm nụ nâng tới của cô xâm lạp hiệp kỳ sinh tiết cô miên phò bà chọi đấy nó cá xu xâm nụ nó mục nâng khiêm mặt mình vô tốt đi tay xông cầu ca này nó xâm lạp cá xu nẹ chấm niên phòng xông ở quân Sẵn kê lục mê tử bí. Thank you, Mr. President. That may have been too quick because I saw that the prosecution wanted to respond to this point. Just for the record, I would like to state that Nguyen Chia would follow this afternoon's proceedings from his holding cell. He is suffering from a headache, back pain, and a lack of concentration, and therefore would like to be in his holding cell this afternoon. I apologize for being too quick. Mr. President, do you wish to hear from us in response to the Inquiry's counsel? I'll be extremely brief on the issue of related question, of uh, leading questions. Um, my friend should be well uh, up to speed with the procedure in court. The appropriate time to place objections is when questions are asked. Um, uh, on the issue of the expert's notes, um, what, what we've observed is that Professor Chandler is simply recording um, uh, the information put to him in questions. He's being asked very complex uh, He's been asked about very complex issues, uh, um, and I think it's entirely appropriate for him to jot down the information that he's being asked to, to respond on. I don't see how um, providing those notes to the court would assist anyone or the parties. Um, we remain, uh, obviously, uh, in the Chamber's hands on this and it, 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 at your discretion, um, but the, the, the information that is crucial is Professor Chandler's um, authored texts, all of which are on the case file, and Professor Chandler's exhaustive testimony. I don't see how the notes will assist in any regard. មកសមគុណហើយសហព័ន្ធយ៉ាងមិនគាត់ឆ្លើយថាអីកំណត់ហេតុនឹងមិនអាចមានផលប្រយោជន៍ទេតែសម្រាប់យើងជាភាគីម
อย่างไรเดี๋ยวองค์จิมเรียบบันจิมเรียบเรียบให้ขนมกิจปิเพศาดังดาวคือเมียนใจฉบับล้อในขนมกรมนิเตปิธีบรมตอนขมายก็โดยเจียในขนมวิเทียนตีขนมสันบักลวนโยลเคยท้าสมนูไอหน้าดลฉบับหามคอดคืออายเลือกมเตจุมโตตอวะได้บางหายให้องค์จิมเรียบตำรัยกะในนิมุยนิมุยเฉียฉบับหายบานในน้อมจะเลือกจะทาเราหายขนมกาอันวัดตั้งปีเดิมที่ในการจับดำสำนักการเรื่องนี้เราหดมาดอปีนี้ปัญหามุทิตคือเชียกำหนดตราคล้ายคล้ายดำไปเอาเมียนกาจองจ้ำให้หนึ่งเงินน้องกายฉลอยโต๊ะปีโปรปัญหานี้เป็นสมกทมัยให้สมนัวเว้นเปียปอนจะมวยหนึ่งกาเรียบจำในกาฉลอยโต๊ะบานปิงลิงตัวตามสมนัวได้สู้โดยเฉพาะสมในกำหนดตราได้ใครใครได้โลกเนี่ยจุ่มเนี้ยเอาจุ่มเดียมันอันยาตีให้จุ่มลอยได้ลอยเจาะจับน้องคือเชียสมเลงเมียนนกนงปฏิจรักกรุบกรอนให้ให้จงกรอยคือเอาจุ่มเดียสำหรับเรือสำหรับส้มระบบลูกนวลจี้อางอยู่เรียบบ้านสนับตำนาส้มระบบลูกนวลจี้ในบ้านเพื่อล้างตามระยะมีตะวีกาเปียกระไรบกวดส้มตื่นตามด้านกิจกรรมนาคาสามนาคาปีจงง่ายตามปอนทอตัวตำนาจะเปลรูเซียนี่ดอยมูลไฮเมียนาการะชื่อจงแก่ไอ้เมียนสถานทพิพทอมทอยในหลักทพิพจองอารมณ์ของการตามด้านกิจกรรมนาคาสัมนาคาโดยตลอดองค์จำเรียสมรัยอยู่พร้อมตามตำนาสมระบบจุนจบเจ้านุนเชียในบ้านสนาสมตามเดียมิตรบีกาปิกรีบกอดสมเตอร์บรรทอตามด้านกิจกรรมนาคาสัมนาคาพิจมงัยตามเดียอบกอสตุสำหรับเยเปิลสัมนาคาเป็นมูริซิลไทยนี่ได้ลุกนวลเชี่ยบานแหลบบังสุดโจรวมต้อนของการจำนาการสำนาการนี้อังยิบเรียต้องมาได้อัยกรมมิตรวิกาปิกระไดลุกนวลเชี่ยกุลมออังยิบเรียเพลียมในเปียสมแหลบบังสุดโจรวมสำนาการได้ต้อนขนมตกสำนาการได้เมียนจูฮัตลิค้าหรือดัชนามเดียมได้เฉียบบ่าปีจุนจอบเจ้านวลเชี่ยพองกอบอยในชอตัวจอบประปอนชอตัวสำหรับจุนจอบเจ้าตรงนี้อายตามด้านการจำนาการสำนาการปียังไงปีบรรทุกคมครวนมุ้ยทัดตะกรองตุบสามนาการนี้ได้มีเรียบจอมอบกอสตุสำหรับจุนจบจอดตรงนี้ให้ประกอบอัยนเรียบจีคุ้มแข็งนอมคลุนจุบจบจอดตั้งปีรูปนวลจีหนึ่งคือสมพ้นตะการประตุขังกรองสาสัปการนี้ให้หนึ่งเนรศีนี้ตกอัยนวลจีตามด้านการจำนาการสามนาการปีอย่างไงปีบรรทุกคุ้มคลุนมุ้ยได้มีอบกอสตุเรียบจอมเฉียดไรจำหรับกอดให้หนึ่งลูกคือสมพ้นอัยนอมกอดลางมากันประตุสามนาการในเว้นใหญ่บานมุนเมามุยสามตัวหนึ่งตีสำหรับจ้อ Hãy subscribe cho kênh Ghiền Mì Gõ Để không bỏ lỡ những video hấp dẫn